Hello everyone. It is just that time again that I'm going to vlog. Um, show you a little bit of this and a little bit of that. For those who are interested to watch. If you're not, just scroll by. <laughs> okay, the next thing I'm going to show. I'm going to try this week to show um, what we eat. What I make for everyone here that I don't record. Uh, sometimes it's very simple foods, sometimes it's not, but I don't record it, so I'll do it for you guys. <laughs> so, one of the meals, it's burgers, and then that is the millis, I put a little butter on, and some salt, and this will be in the oven for about 20 minutes. Okay, I've just come outside now to show you guys that the guava tree is busy really showing off I have taken off many many guavas small guavas and they call it thinning so that the ones that remain uh, has a better chance of growing bigger and sweeter so there were many sacrifices hey, there's some of them laying there I'm supposed to pick it up okay and um, and yes I do have white guavas as well I still didn't get anyone to adopt the pink one. See now here, this is too many on a on a branch. So I take off. Let me see, and that one. Take that one off. Where else? Let me see. And take one off there. Yeah, and that's how you thin out your tree, so you don't, um, so you can get nice amounts big guavas. Oh, this bunch is a bit fat. Okay, yeah, I'll take this one off. And that one. There we go. And that's how you thin a tree. The locusts, there's a bee. It's the liquid flowers, it smells amazing. The bees are just enjoying themselves. And yes, the white guava tree, there's two. And they also, here's the white guava. I'll show you as it goes along guys what's happening okay I'm gonna go in and check on the food what's that plant that is not a guava plant what can it be can you guys see the leaves are different hmm interesting very very interesting if anyone knows what kind of plant or tree this is going to be, let me know, guys. I don't know if you guys know, but I like chicken bones. So, they will just take from the fork the chicken off the bone and give me the bones because from a young child, I like eating chicken bones. I'll take off the meat and have the bones on its own. <laughs> this is how you do it. <laughs> Sorry, say, say hello to the people before you get your treat. Ooh, wait, can you catch it? Catch it? Hey, yo, hey, yo. I was just showing me the nice flowers. Look at that. Mm -hmm. I think I must wash all the water in this thing. Mm. You see this one? Oh, it's beautiful. Wow. Okay, the burgers are out. Millies are done. I normally just put the millies for 15 minutes in the oven. Um, I love it. My, my preferred way of having millies is in the oven. Okay, or on the coals, but just for like 5-10 minutes. Okay, and then what I made, just simple, your... Tomato, onion, cucumber, lettuce, some 
just whatever I found here in that supper and I put some Tabasco sauce over the millis and over the burgers so they can either have um, lettuce burgers or they can chop up the lettuce and make a little salad for them and then that's done <laughs> yes simple and easy anyways guys that's my very very short vlog just to show you what I do when I'm not recording videos for you guys and when we're just having whatever for supper or lunch <laughs> anyways love you guys and I'll be back again with another vlog bye love you <laughs>